Hey guys, welcome. Uh, you guys made it to week two, so that's a good sign. Uh, you're halfway there. Um, my name is Jeff Seaman, and as I mentioned, uh, each week I try to do a video lecture. Um, I want to make this uh, environment, even though it's an online class, I want to make it as realistic as possible, as if you had to come to class and listen to me lecture. Um, so I try to do it as close as possible. So hopefully at this point, um, you've got uh, your gel account installed. And that is not easy. Uh, that was the reason I created the video. Uh, there are some steps in there that gets confusing. Um, I do know that some of you have had some issues and I'm working my best to get to it. Um, it's just that sometimes these things happen and it's just common. So uh, do not get frustrated if you haven't got it resolved or I haven't helped you get it resolved yet. It'll happen, it's just these things happen. Um, so we'll work on getting that resolved. Um, it's important that you do have your gel account um, so that you can connect to my, my SQL Workbench. Now this class itself is eight weeks long, but there is a lot of stuff that we give out. Um, but the good thing is, since it's an eight week class, there's no midterm, there's no final, and there's no final project. Um, I just didn't think it was enough um, time in eight weeks to give you all that information. Even though I've had classes that are eight weeks long and all that's included, but I try not to include it. I try to give you, I want you to really learn something out of it. And it'll be basically week by week you learn something new. So this week, um, it's and you'll notice it's kind of kind of go over two topics. So this week we're going to talk about the MySQL Workbench. So I'll bring over MySQL Workbench, and I'll show you how it works. So that way, once you get to that point, you'll be able to work, um, be able to use it. Now the thing is, we have videos out there on MySQL Workbench. Um, I'll show you where our videos are at. Um, just if you haven't seen it, just a, as an FYI. Uh, the other thing is, um, <clears throat> we'll talk about how to write some queries. So we'll go through and actually write some code and um, show you how the code works. Um, so this may be your first experience writing code. Maybe you're, you may, may have seen it before. Not a big deal. Um, so first and foremost, um, today's, my glasses on here so I can read this. Um, today's objectives are in regards to MySQL Workbench, which is uh, very common. That's what we want to learn about. Uh, one second, sorry. All right. So um, I'm going to teach you how to use MySQL Workbench. Um, that's the common thing. So let me pull it over here. All right, where is that at? Here, now, as you see here, I have a bunch of accounts. These are just students' accounts that I've helped along the way. But when you do it for the first time, you're just gonna come in here and you're gonna put, you could give it any type of name, it doesn't matter what. Let's say, um, for example, let's say uh, Shannon. Uh, Shannon's account, no big deal. Um, this is where you're gonna put your username. So, um, let's see here, sorry. Come unprepared here. Let me find an actual user account. I'm going to find someone in this class so I give you a good example. I don't remember these offhand. And the crazy thing is, spring classes are around the corner and they're already um, filling up my schoology. And your class is happening right now and it's already been archived, which is ridiculous. All right, let's see here. Attendance, members. All right, I said Shannon Murata. Hopefully I didn't butcher your last name, Shannon. So, in her case, all right, where is my mouse, sorry. So, it's like her user ID is S-C-M-O-R-A-D, okay? So it'd be .it .point park .edu. So everybody here, whatever your user ID is that I gave you, you figure it out, it's that .it .point park .edu. That is your username. The, the thing is, it gets um, easily uh, confused because people think it's the uh, your when you're doing SSH and, or whatever, and it's your username at user ID. It's just this right here. So that's the host, that's the location where it's at. Um, the port number is 3306. Username will be root. And now, I, I don't know if this is working yet, so I'm hit test connection. I don't know Shannon's password, so it's not gonna work. So the first time you do, it's gonna pop up and ask for your username and password. 
and then you're going to enter your password and you'll have the possibility of storing it in your keychain if you're using a mac if not you won't so for example if i go over to my account that's already set up you see it has this right here i click on it it will open up oh look at this now it's going to play games with me why is it not working am i connected to the internet i am all right check that my sql is running all right that's beautiful so now let's see what's happening with my account I know that yesterday there was an outage at Point Park. So I'm wondering if that's still going on. So we'll find out in a second if I can SSH into my account. So you see that right there? That tells me that they're having issues with the server. Just when I start making a video, they're gonna have problems there, beautiful. So this is going to be a continued video, it looks like, because I can't show you anything if I can't connect. So let's see here. Let me go to my website. So website works. All right. So let's do this. All right. So there's something going on. So our domain is down for a second. That is not good. Um, hmm. So you can't resolve it because it doesn't exist. But if I do, so it's like our subdomain is down for some reason. This happened yesterday. Um, everything went haywire. All right, so um, I can't even show you how to work this, or I can't even show you how to write SQL code because, well, I have no connection. Um, I don't have this installed locally so that Will not be the answer there. Um, so this is the first of two videos, it looks like. Video number one, uh, the service is down. So I'm going to pause this and come back for a second. Maybe it came back. One second. Only this is an issue. So let me let everyone know. Um, oops, it appears that it.pointpark.edu is has crashed at the moment. Your gel accounts will not work. Until this is resolved. All right, so I threw that out there. All right, so this is beautiful. Welcome to Point Park, guys. Um, this usually doesn't happen. Uh, maybe it's gonna be working. It's gonna call me a liar here in a second. Beautiful. So I already liked it, Sammy. Have you guys met Sammy? Not yet. Give it time. Okay. Huh. So one student said hers is working. Interesting. Sorry to keep you guys going here. Maybe it's just me. If you guys you haven't met this, so Sabrina is the president of the ITSO club, which is the um, Information Technologies uh, Student Organization uh, within Point Park. So she's a second year college student, and she is the president of the club. Um, very knowledgeable person. If you have any questions, um, I definitely recommend talking to her. She can be very helpful. 
Um, let's go back to my terminal. I guess this is a sign that I need to take a break and quit working today. Don't work too hard. All right, so let's go to the window. Let's try this again. Maybe I'm just losing my mind. Um, ah, still, um, I'm just showing people that I am not losing my mind. All right, so this will end this first video that was nothing. Um, so hopefully you guys had, did have an opportunity to get on Slack here. I do need to put you guys all in this directory here, which is uh, you guys are online somewhere. Uh, where are you guys at? Um, one online fall, or 19 fall online right here. So I need to make sure everybody's in here. Um, maybe we just have one person, which is me. So I need to put you guys in here. Um, but you get those stuff in, uh, in there or, or send me messages directly, whatever the case is. Um, so I apologize. This is a first video, two videos. So next video, we will talk about my SQL workbench, show you around, and then we'll actually write some code. So I'll talk to you guys soon. Thanks. Bye.